In recent months, China's rumored next-generation fighter, known as the J-50, has leapt from speculation to reality. Satellite photos, leaked videos, and eyewitness accounts from late 2024 through early 2025 reveal a stealth aircraft under testing at Shenyang Aircraft Corporation, with a tailless design, swept fuselage, and radar-absorbing surfaces. Analysts believe this jet could be one of two sixth-generation projects China is pursuing in parallel, alongside the heavier J-36 from Chengdu. Together, they represent the clearest signal, yet that Beijing is accelerating efforts to challenge U.S. air dominance and reshape the balance of global air power. This aircraft is not simply an evolution of predecessors like the J-20, but quantum leap in aerospace technology. From its radical aerodynamic design and cutting-edge engine technology to its integration of artificial intelligence and ability to operate alongside combat drones, the J-50 is described as a prototype sixth-generation jet that could redefine air supremacy. Every leak, every allegation, is just a piece of the bigger picture Beijing is trying to conceal, a subtle message that China is no longer content to be a follower, but is ready to lead. The first move that caught the world by surprise was its futuristic design, devoid of conventional vertical fins. While the J-20 retains a shape similar to the F-22 Raptor, the J-50 looks like a plane from the future. Its silhouette is sleek, sharp, and virtually devoid of radar-reflecting angles. Some analysts suggest the J-50 features adaptive folding fins, an innovation that allows the aircraft to change its shape depending on combat conditions. When the fins are folded, radar reflections can be suppressed to near undetectable levels, while during extreme maneuvers the fins can deploy automatically for stability. This design philosophy signals China's willingness to go beyond copying Western templates and push its own vision of next-generation stealth. At the heart of this war machine, the J-50 is believed to be equipped with the WS-15 Enhanced, the latest variant of a domestically developed turbofan engine. This engine is claimed to generate tremendous thrust for sustained supersonic speeds, supercruise, without the aid of afterburners, a feature long associated with the F-22 Raptor. If confirmed, the combination of aerodynamic design and powerful engine performance would place the J-50 in a league of its own, potentially surpassing Western fifth-generation jets in speed, range, and stealth. For decades, the Achilles heel of Chinese aviation was engine technology. If the J-50 truly flies with a reliable WS-15, it means Beijing has finally broken free from dependency on Russian propulsion systems. Some unverified reports suggest the WS-15 could generate upwards of 180 kilonewtons of thrust, putting on par or even above the Pratt and Whitney F-119 engine powering the F-22. Despite its technological sophistication, the J-50 appears to be designed for more than just land-based operations. There is strong speculation that it is geared toward carrier deployment, making a perfect match for China's expanding naval fleet. With the Type 003 Fujian already undergoing trials and plans underway to build a nuclear-powered carrier, the J-50 could become Beijing's trump card projecting naval power throughout the Indo-Pacific. If the rumors of folding wings, reinforced landing gear, and electromagnetic catapult compatibility are true, then the J-50 may soon dominate not only runways, but also the seas. Imagine a scenario where a J-50 takes off from the deck of an aircraft carrier in the South China Sea, then climbs a high altitude with a combat range capable of penetrating artificial island defenses, enemy air bases, and even American defense lines in the Pacific. With its stealth capabilities and extended range, the J-50 could challenge America's long-held air superiority over carrier groups. Its presence at sea could alter the balance of power, placing pressure on U.S. allies like Japan, South Korea, and Australia. For the first time, Washington might face the prospect of contested skies over its own Pacific bases. Analysts estimate that with aerial refueling, the J-50 could achieve a combat radius of over 2,000 kilometers, enough to reach Guam or even threaten Hawaii with standoff weapons. But the J-50's advantages may not stop there. One of the most exciting speculations is the aircraft's potential to command a fleet of autonomous combat drones. This concept, known as a loyal wingman, envisions a single pilot controlling a mothership while dozens of unmanned drones move in formation, attacking targets, performing diversions, and wreaking havoc on the battlefield. If realized, this system would allow China to turn a single jet into a swarm commander, 
overwhelming enemy defenses with sheer numbers and unpredictable tactics. If China successfully integrates this system into the J-50, the aircraft will become not just a stealth jet, but an intelligent airborne command center capable of launching simultaneous multidimensional attacks. Imagine a single J-50 escorted by dozens of armed drones, moving rapidly, attacking from multiple directions, and overwhelming the enemy. Such a system will provide a tactical advantage while ushering in a new era of AI-driven air warfare, where the speed of human decision-making might no longer keep pace with machine algorithms. This is not just about faster jets. It is about faster wars, where artificial intelligence dictates the tempo of conflict. The U.S. Air Force itself has admitted that swarming tactics could be the future. Yet China may be the first to put this theory into practice. More than just a military project, the J-50 symbolizes China's technological independence. For years, Beijing has often been accused of copying Western or Russian technology. However, the J-50 is seen by some as proof that the era of imitation is over. Its engines, radars, avionics, and weapon systems are said to be developed domestically, demonstrating newfound confidence in China's aerospace industry. If the J-20 was about proving China could build a fifth-generation jet, the J-50 may be about proving it can innovate beyond anyone else. Reports claim the jet may carry a next-generation ASA radar with over 2,000 transmit-receive modules, rivaling or even surpassing the F-35's APG-81. For Beijing, the J-50 is not just a tool of war, but also a geopolitical statement that is capable of creating technology equal to or even surpassing that of Western nations. Every test flight, every satellite leak, seems to be a subtle message to Washington, Moscow, and the rest of the world. America's era of air dominance will not last forever. The J-50 is as much a weapon of psychology as it is of steel and composites. Despite the growing rumors, the J-50 project remains tightly guarded. There have been no official statements from the Chinese government, only blurry footage and intelligence reports that leave analysts guessing. This secrecy itself has become a psychological weapon, forcing other countries to speculate, raise defense budgets, and accelerate their own next-generation fighter programs. By refusing to confirm or deny, Beijing forces Washington to prepare for the worst, draining billions from U.S. defense coffers. The United States with its next-generation air dominance program, Russia with its Sioux, 57, and PAC DP projects, and European nations like France and Germany with their FCS initiatives are all racing to stay ahead of the curve. The competition for dominance in future skies has begun, and the J-50 stands as a key driver of new global tensions. What was once a quiet competition has become a high-stakes arms race, with the J-50 at the center of it all. Military think tanks estimate that by 2040, at least five major sixth-generation fighters will be operational worldwide, but China's J-50 could be the first to break cover. If all the speculation proves true, the J-50 is more than just a fighter. It marks a new chapter in military history, a war machine relying not only on speed and destructive power, but also on artificial intelligence, collaborative operations with drones, and near-perfect stealth. The world may be witnessing the birth of a sky ghost that could force the United States and its allies to rewrite their air defense doctrines. The F-22 and F-35 may soon face an adversary designed not to match them, but to eclipse them. Yet, until China fully lifts the veil of secrecy, one question remains. Will the J-50 truly revolutionize modern air warfare, or is it merely an illusion Beijing cultivates to intimidate its opponents? History has seen many paper tigers, but has also seen moments when a single breakthrough redefined the battlefield. The J-50 might be remembered as China's boldest gamble or its greatest triumph. What do you think? Is the world ready for a new era of Chinese stealth power, or is this only the spark that could ignite the most dangerous arms race of the 21st century?